you know, my whole business model, this whole YouTube thing that I'm doing, I make self-improvement videos. The point of those are to teach you how to become a better person. I provide value for you, teaching you to become a better person. Yet, you know, I think a majority of the people who watch my videos and the majority of people out there, they don't want to improve themselves. I genuinely think a lot of people just are complacent and they're okay with being a loser. I, I, I'm wondering, I'm in confusion. I like how you don't wake up every morning with this burning desire to want to like be the best, to conquer, to like conquer earth, be super successful. I don't know how you wake up and not feel that way. How you just okay with being a loser, you accept defeat. I guess it's just like, I guess people are just raised that way because, you know, the big wigs at top, the big wigs on top, it's like, it makes the competition easier, I guess. That's a way of seeing it. If nobody else wants to level up, then it's pretty easy. It's pretty easy to become a success these days because nobody wants to become successful. I, I hate to use this as an example, but like I show my mom, do this right now, like do this and it will make your life better, I promise. It will make your life better if you can just do this every day. It'll only take like five minutes or whatever. Just try this out. And people, they just don't want to improve themselves. <laughs> I hate to say it. My whole business model re revolves around wanting people, uh, around people wanting to improve themselves. And people just don't want to. <sighs> and I think there's a few reasons for this. The first reason is going to be stimulation. People these days, everybody you see these days is... It's actually crazy to think about it, but everybody these days, you see them, 15-year-olds, teenagers, up to like 40-year-olds, you just see them doing this one thing. They're on their phones looking at these TikToks, scrolling, and th whenever they get bored, whenever they're in line waiting, whenever their mind's not occupied, their first reaction is to go straight to their phone and just go straight to those TikToks and entertain themselves. I find it crazy how everybody these days is doing the same exact thing and it's completely pointless. <laughs> it's completely pointless watching TikToks. You cannot tell me with a straight face that watching TikToks gives you any remote value. It doesn't make you richer. It doesn't give you good information, really. Be like, oh, it, uh, it's entertaining. So what? Do you really, entertainment, what does entertainment really do for you, man? So what? I can be entertained all day. I, I spent my, uh, the entirety of my middle school year being entertained, playing Fortnite all day, every day. And guess where that got me? Literally nowhere. I was, stayed the same exact person, even worse. I was, like, wasting all my time. I had a pretty shit mentality, shit mental health. Is no, entertainment does nothing good for you. Watching TV. All it is is just a distraction. I think... This entertainment is distracting you from how shitty your life is. All these TikToks, video games, all the stimulation, all the noise. Listen, people, music addicts, nobody wants to be in the silence. Everybody, the second that they're confronted with a boring moment or something, their first reaction is just to cut it out, stimulation immediately, and buzz out all the noise. And that's why I think a lot of people these days are complacent and they don't try to improve themselves. It's these companies, the social media, all the way that our society these days is set up. is There's all this stimulation. It's just distracting you. You, you know, it's like... Uh, how should I say this? Like, uh, like a sheep to the slaughterhouse, you know? That's basically how people live. And then they're distracting you just by like feeding you every day, like, giving you these small liberties, like, they give you, like, an iPad, it's like giving an iPad, a child an iPad as a substitute for actually having the parent come out and actually teaching the kid lessons, spending time with them, you give them an iPad, that's, like, how society is, it distracts you from actually wanting to achieve things and do things with your life, instead just gives you, like, TikToks, music, video games, to distract you from everything else going on in your life. 
And I think that's the main reason people these days don't have a burning desire to want to conquer and become better people. They're distracted. So, right now, after the, you're finished watching this video, here's an actionable step for you. And really quickly, I want to talk about taking action. Because watching these videos and all, it's cool and all that you're watching these videos, that you're actually... I'm assuming that you actually want to improve yourself if you're watching these videos because that's the kind of content I make. And I assume you're going to want to actually implement it into your life. Watching these videos does nothing for you if you're not going to implement it and take action. You need to stop overthinking everything and just take action. So after this video, I'm going to give you some simple steps. Delete all the stimulation off your phone, off your PS4, whatever. Go to your, go to your phone. And just all that stimulation shit, I don't care, fucking Instagram, YouTube, Spotify, uh, just YouTube, all that stuff you use just to entertain yourself and keep yourself stimulated and distracted from how horrible your life is. Like, doing the dishes or whatever, you're doing some yard work and you just put on, like, a podcast in the background to distract you from how shitty of a situation you're in. Just cut all that shit out, delete YouTube, delete YouTube, Spotify. And then just let it sink in how shitty you have it. And start not being so complacent. Start chasing wanting to be better. You're going to realize that, you know, I m maybe I have like a shitty physique and I've been neglecting this. Because I don't really have to worry about it when I'm entertained with video games. Now that you're kind of unplugged from the matrix, you can see, you know, my life's pretty shit. Let's work on this. Let's tackle some of these things. Let's address our problems and make our life better. I hope this helps you if you're finding yourself being complacent, if you don't want to improve yourself. This is my best advice for you. Cut out all the stimulation, all the noise, so you can focus. Focus is the most important thing. People who are successful, they manage to focus on one thing for a long time, get really good at it. People can't focus these days because they're distracted. So cut out all the noise, all the extra bullshit. Cut the fat from your uh, the information. Like cut that fatty information and really focus and dial in on the important shit in your life. I hope this helps. Real quickly, um, I kind of like stop with the mentorship, but... I'm going to kind of make a movement for some of you guys if to like help my viewers out. For right now, if you want to just keep up to date with that and be, have access to it when I launch it, I'm having my Discords. I have those links in the description. My Discord, you can check it out. You don't have to get my mentorship. But see you guys in the next video.